Equatorial Guinea wanted to compete in the Olympics and they didn't have any representation. They put out an announcement on the radio and TV. We need people, we need volunteers to swim at the Olympics in Sydney on behalf of our country. And Eric Musambani was the only one that showed up. And you know, there's this thing called due diligence. The due diligence here was, hey, do you know how to swim? He's like, yeah. I can dog paddle. So they're like, go ahead, get your training, and we'll see you later. Unfortunately for Eric, he had never been in an Olympic pool in his life, and he had never competed in any sort of swimming competition ever. In fact, he'd never swam a full 100 meters before. So he trained in the ocean, and come to find out, it was the fishermen that were teaching him how to swim. So this guy, Eric Musambani, shows up to the Olympics with no experience and wins the first heat to the 2000 Sydney Olympics. And people are mind blown. And that story teaches us some very important lessons. Number one is sometimes you win just by showing up. Number two, sometimes you win because other people don't last. But you always win when you go through to the finish line.